I'm Dick Axelrod, and my book is Terms of Engagement, Changing the Way We Change Organizations. Terms of Engagement is a guidebook for change. It's based on four principles, widening the circle of involvement, connecting people to each other and to ideas, creating communities for action, and embracing democracy. The book came about uh, as a result of some work actually we were doing with Peter Block. And the work was, how do we provide line managers with OD skills? How do we take the skills that are normally in the hands of consultants and give them away, you know, give them to line managers so they can do the things we do? So what we started to experiment with was how do you teach line managers to, you know, lead, affect, create large system change? And as we did these workshops, certain principles began to emerge. In 2000, Boeing applied these principles in a kind of unique way. Uh, in 99, they had the largest white collar strike in U.S. history. And, they really, and this was in the Boeing commercial engineering function. So we have about 15,000 engineers. You know, there was a lot of connection about you know, people wanting things to be better. So what people began to learn was you know, everybody was sort of hurt and everybody wanted, they never wanted to go through that again and everybody wanted the organization to be better. And Hank Queen, who was the VP of uh, engineering at the time, realized that one of the ways to repair things was to give people local control about what needed changing. And so what he, what he did was um, say, okay, we're going to employ these four principles. You can employ them in any kind of way. And then what we did was we trained about 20 groups, local groups, on these principles, and they had the freedom to do whatever they want. So and locally, they began to create communities for action around things that were important to them. So in some groups, people uh, redesigned the uh, first day on the job experience for people. In other uh, groups, people did sophisticated things like redesigning the process by which engineering drawings were released. So Boeing used these four principles, widening the circle of involvement, connecting people to each other in ideas, creating communities for action, and embracing democracy. And the result they got from employing these principles was that they had a 40% improvement in employee satisfaction three years later. The ideal takeaway for me, for people who read this book, is that they're self-sufficient. That And, and the, one of the most gratifying things that's happened since the book is I see it quoted in other books with other people's changes, and I have no idea what, I mean, they didn't even call me, all right? So that they were able to read the book, apply the principles, and uh, I see it quoted in another change book. And they say, oh, and we use these principles to affect this, this change, like American Airlines was in one example of that. I, I had no idea it was uh, actually happening, but got called by the editor and saying, you know, they wanted to you know, make sure all the uh, attributions were right and stuff like that. And now that's super gratifying.